Right guys, how are you doing? I'm uploading a video. Guess what? This is the fucking sixth attempt now because my missus has rung me literally three times in three of the videos that I've tried to upload for you guys. She's fucking doing me head in, bless her. You know, she's been lovely this morning. She's got me up. She's made me a cup of coffee in the old motivational unicorn cup, bless her. Now, on with the fucking video, I am trying to get a video to you guys because I am aware, as of the last two weeks, I have not made any videos. I did attempt one last week, which was the 7th of uh, August on Tuesday, which was basically marking my 50th day and 99th, give or take a few, 99th application of minoxidil. Now, as of today, it marks the 18th of August, which is the end of my second month and the beginning of my third month. Henceforth, where's my minoxidil? I've put it down somewhere. It's basically, it's in my cupboard. I thought I had it in here. I did in the last five videos that I've attempted to make. I was gonna show you, I've got a brand new bottle of uh, minoxidil, but I have a six month supply. You get it in a little box from Kirkland. <coughs> basically what's happening is um, I've been slammed out of work. And I'm getting seven days a week in at the minute. This weekend is the first weekend I've had free. I think last weekend I've worked six days. Regardless, I did attempt to get you a video. Uh, Bradley, thanks for your message, mate. I appreciate that. I'm, I'm doing good. The beard's coming on fine. Uh, I am here now doing another video because the last one just basically wouldn't upload. I tried and tried. It just kept getting fucked off. So I eventually went, fuck it. I deleted it and here I am because, you know, in hindsight, marking the 50th was... 10 days away from being the 60th end of month two so what's the point I just thought let's fuck it off and then try and get a video done this weekend so I'm going to try and make this video brief compress everything into it as quickly as I can do I'll try not to waffle on I'm now on my third cup of coffee this morning and I want to get to the fucking gym basically so what's happened is I've been having you know while the sun's been out and bright and sunny the pollen count's been sky high and I've been getting hay fever uh, this last couple of months over summertime and I've never had hay fever in my entire life but it just seems that now that I'm 40 I'm, I'm getting all these ailments and what have you and it just seems like I'm fucking I'm not 20 anymore I'm like what's happened I've gone from 20 to 40 where's these last 20 fucking years gone but yeah month two ended starting month three I have got a brand new bottle of Kirkland solution I uh Prepped it up last night. I put the L-carnitine Altartra in with one of my daughter's pink spoons that she's got in a little tea set and it's about the size of my thumb is the spoon and it's just the right measurement for the 60ml amount of um, Kirkland Minoxidil. I also have this that I've stolen from my daughter which is a little pink comb and it just basically combs through the beard that I've got and it keeps it nice and neat because you can see now that I've combed it you get all these little stragglers go ping 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 and this is what I was trying to highlight in my video that I made last week that didn't get uploaded. I had a trim last week, which is a very, very tiny little trim. I basically trimmed my moustache and made this line nice and neat, which is now becoming a little more unruly. And this triangle of hair, I don't know if you can see, I'll put the light on. It's a bit better. This triangle of hair that I get here starts on the top lip and it kind of tapers in like that. It's kind of like a, a sort of pocket, these two pockets here of skin, and it tapers in. So what I did is I straightened it up so I had like a little line of hair there and then I just very carefully trimmed these little long hairs off but they just keep, keep popping back out. So it could be just random hairs. I'm getting to the point now with this growth that it's, it's about eight weeks in now is this growth. Um, it's been amplified by the Kirkland obviously and the supplementation that I've been taking but I'm gonna try and do this categorically. So the beard first, here's how it looks. Might be better if I kinda take it off and give you a bit of a close up. Now, it's quite dense and it looks, if you look at it from the front, you can see it looks like I've got a full beard almost growing up that side and that side, but there you go. That's the result you can see. I'm just looking round. You see the nice neckline, you can see the patches, you know, this side. And that's it. Now, whilst I'm on the beard subject, do you guys have a weak side and a strong side? For me, my weak side is my right side. And my strong side is my left side, as you can tell. It looks more dense with hair. It's made up, obviously now that I've been on the Kirkland, it's made up of 
a lot of vellus and the terminals obviously are showing but because I've been growing it for long like two months so it's grown long now so if I can get me fucking England right English uh, that's basically what's happening so this is how it looks this is after two months of growth almost and on the Kirkland Minoxidil leading me to the supplementation. Now, I am taking folic acid in the morning, CLA, which is conjugated lyalinic acid, and I'm also taking diatomaceous earth. I know I said tenacious D because my missus calls it tenacious D because she takes the supplement as well. She's also a bit of a, you know, I'm not, I'm not saying I'm a fitness freak, but she's a bit of a fitness freak. She's in gym morning, noon and night. She keeps herself trim. She's a personal trainer. She does all the beauty therapy. She's way busy, like I'm busy doing my job and trying to get to the gym. <laughs> I'm doing it twice a week at minute. So this lifestyle change for me, it's, it's not a lifestyle change, it's more just giving it a quick boost because I always used to be in the gym, I used to be doing it every day, you know, and now I'm like, I'm in my 40s. I've just started, you know, my 40th year and this is how it is. So supplementation, tick, beard look, check, tick. Diary in the background, little red book. Tick. What I do is on every single day, I <coughs> I just put a little M. So for example, we're now on Saturday the 18th, which is down at the bottom here, if you can see. And every day, if you notice, I've got a little M and I put equals two. Today marks the third month beginning, uh, second month end, and I've just put a little M next to each day. I don't know why Moleskine diaries. They always put Saturday and Sunday next to each other in the bottom column. When Friday, Thursday, Wednesday, Tuesday, Monday. They've got a big fucking column to themselves, so who knows? I've been using them for years. I've not complained about it. I'm not complaining, but that's my little moan about that bit. Every day, M equals two. Occasionally, I put M equals one when I couldn't be asked, and then on other days, I've just put Dermarold, which I've only done once. Now, that's slightly leading me on to Dermarold. In. I haven't yet done it twice. I've done it once. Did it, I think it was three weeks ago, nearly a month ago now. No particular reason. Not afraid of it, doesn't bother me all that much. Uh, I have done it, excuse me why I inappropriately adjust my fucking tackle. Dermarolling is just dermarolling. It does help, it's part of the routine on this monoxidal thing and I'm going to do it tomorrow. Uh, that's the intention, it will be the 19th of August tomorrow. So I'm gonna just leave it out, I'm gonna do, with it being like 25 past 12 now, I've been doing this video since about 11 o'clock and it's like the sixth fucking video, this is the sixth attempt, and our lass has run me a few times and broke it up, or I've fucked up, and I've made a mistake, and I've had to restart it, so, sixth and final video, the Dermarolin thing, I am just gonna do it tomorrow, I'm gonna have a day off from the tomorrow, I'm gonna do the Dermarolin either in the morning or the afternoon, and leave it until Monday night, and I'm gonna reapply Minoxidil Monday morning or Monday night, depending on the length of time I've left between, because they say the minimum is 24 hours, so, the Dermarolin thing. Uh, I've also bought myself some two gain 10%. The reason being is because I'm going on holiday for a fortnight at the end of September, beginning of October, and I don't want to be applying Minoxidil in a morning at 5% and then doing it uh, in an evening at 5% because obviously when I'm on holiday, it's a bright sunny place, it's Lanzarote, it's just north of Africa, it's, it's part of Spain, it's fucking red hot all year round and there's lots of sun. I don't want to be putting minoxidil on in the morning after I have my shower and then going out to the beach, to the poolside, walking around, whatever me and my missus and family are doing, and then wasting the time putting the minoxidil in. So the plan is, for the minoxidil, is buy the two gain 10%, big tick, done, wait for that to arrive, and I'm gonna use that in an evening whilst I'm on holiday. But I'll give you more details about that. I may even do a couple of videos whilst I'm on all day. I might do a couple of beach videos, a bit of walking around. You know, these iPhone 10s that can do 4K videos now and it looks fucking incredible. So I might give you a nice holiday video. Um, we'll see. I'll just, I'll, I'll, I'll post some random videos. I've got a nice new case from, uh, I think it's Ghost Tech, the Nautical 2, which makes, I mean, I know the iPhone 10's waterproof anyway, but with this case on it, I can... Go snorkeling with it, I think it's like IP68 rated, which means it's waterproof to about 10 metres deep or something. Or I think it's about 20 foot, it works out, so you can go snorkeling with it. Uh, I'm prepping up for holiday, like I say, I'm getting the two gain 10%. I've bought the waterproof case for my phone, so I can take it in, a, in on the beach, in the pool, wherever, you know. I've also got myself one of them snorkeling masks rather than the snorkel pipe and the goggles. I've got one of the full face masks, 
so that I can go snorkeling. And, I'm, and we're going to get a GoPro t attached to it because you can get a little uh, attachment thing on the snorkel itself. Who knows? I'll do that video. I'm rambling again. I know I have an habit of doing that, but basically this is my update and I'm just letting you know, uh, Bradley in particular, because you messaged me about, I think it was four or five days ago now, just asking how I was, you've not seen any videos for a couple of weeks, you know, showed a little bit of concern and I do appreciate that, mate. I'm really grateful for that, but here I am. I'm fine. I did reply to you, by the way, pal, um, it's in the comments underneath yours, um, just brief, letting you know what's going on. Uh, so yeah, here's the video that I intended to do last week at the 50th attempt, which is now at month two, ending beginning of month three. So yeah, I'm sticking with it. I'm doing everything I can. Supplementation, I've not done the derma rolling. Uh, I'm training more now as I can do in between work. Uh, I'm currently doing it about, I think I'm managing about two or three times a week around work, but with me being busy recently, I've probably managed about once a week in the last couple of months. And obviously we've been summer, I've just been in the garden, chilling with Mrs. at Little and, and getting out and doing things while, you know, summer holidays have been about. And now the kids are on holiday from school, so I'm seeing more of my daughter. Um, you know, she's currently on holiday with her mum, uh, centre parts I think she's gone to. So yeah, it's, it's just at this point now where the beard's starting to come along, capping that shit off. This is how it is. Um, I'm going to go to the gym now, or I might even just go to the gym and do like half an hour on treadmill and come on because I'm, I'm not feeling too good with this cold. My head's a bit bunged up and foggy, as you all, all know when you get man flu or cold. My eyes are a bit itchy. Uh, I've still got my noxal on my first one last night. I think I applied it about, uh, will have been about eight o'clock-ish last night, and I've still got it on now. And the time is almost half past 12. Um, it's only got to half past 12 because this is like the sixth attempt at doing this fucking video for you guys. So my apologies for that. I'm a bit cagey, a bit ratty, slightly in a rush, on my third cup of coffee. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm ready for going to the gym now. So this is just basically a little quarter an hour video that I'm gonna do for you guys. Um, and I'll probably try to get another one done. I might do another one tomorrow with my derma roll. It, it depends really. I don't like doing videos when little one's about, he's only two and he's in and out, grabbing things, daddy, daddy, daddy. And I've got our missus asking me questions, you know. <coughs> Great quote that I've seen in a cup. You know, if you ask a man to do it, there's no need to nag him every six months, which I found very fucking funny. I'd seen it on Facebook the other day. I've got a Facebook page, if you want to go find it, it's just, it's not a... A minoxidil beard paid, but you know, there's the beard, I think is it Bearded Alley's uh, minoxidil beard spot, I think they call it, I'm, I'm part of that. Uh, I put a picture on it last week, week before. Uh, obviously I've got my YouTube channel that I'm trying to keep updated as best as possible. Um, I've got Instagram, you can find me on there, I don't know what my name is, you just have to find it on, on links on there. I've got Twitter, I don't use that. Uh, you're welcome to subscribe, you're welcome to like, if you will, all the videos that I've done. If you have any comments, any questions, by all means, you know, put them in there. I don't mind answering the questions. I will, when I've got the time, sit down and reply back to you. Like I say, it's now, you know, I think it's four days on from when Brad asked if I were alright. Bradley, sorry, if that's how you call yourself. Uh, it's just, it's been a busy week at work, so it's, it's one of those things. Some weeks I can go where I've only got three days work on, and some weeks I can go full seven. So if I get those couple of days off, what I try and do is get a few things sold. I've got loads of clothes that I'm trying to get rid of at the minute because I'm trying to update my wardrobe. Uh, I've just bought myself some new boots from Timberland and I end up getting myself two pairs of them. They were so cheap and I've got myself some new trainers, some nice epic reacts, I bought them for holiday. And, uh, much to my missus dismay, I've got a wardrobe full of trainers, you see, and I need to, she says, Get rid of the old ones if you're not using them. Some of them are brand new, I've worn them a couple of times. Um, so I'm selling them on my Facebook page when I get around to doing it. So, busy, busy, busy. Try to do a lot of things, try to get a lot of things sold, get all the old things out and get all so, some new things. Henceforth, I am buying, I've got a wardrobe full of half shaves. I'm gonna keep buying half shaves. I use them, I like them, and then I stop using them because I buy another one, and then I get bored of that one, and then buy another one, and then I ask like, what the fuck are you doing, Chris? You've got a wardrobe full of trainers, full of diesel jeans, full of, you know, aftershaves. Went, fucking get shut of it, clear some space, and just have one or two aftershaves, one or two pairs of trainers. So, that's what I'm doing. That's what I'm trying to do. Around work, around, try to fit Jim in, and then doing my monoxidal journey. I think I just need to get a lot more organised than what I am. Basically, you know, my missus has got diaries for everything, and I know I say I've got a diary, but I don't use it like 
a proper diary should be used. Like, I brush my teeth, I've got an appointment for a dentist. I just kind of use my iPhone and fucking write it down on the calendar there and negate the diary of redness. So, yeah. I would advise getting a diary and using it properly, guys. This diary basically is just for, like special events, birthdays, Christmases, stuff that we've got planned around them days, and then mainly my minoxidil. This is it. The red moleskin, moleskin, whatever, how you pronounce it. I have used these for a lot of years, but I just, I get them bought for me basically, and I just say thanks, and then I go, right, it's in my drawer, and I don't use it right often. I'm not good at putting pen to paper. I just, I can't always be asked basically. I've got a lot of things going on. So yeah, I'm going to cap this video off now because it's just done over 15 minutes and I always waffle and randomly talk about shit and they're not very constructive these videos, they're not articulated or whatever. I've tried to get things categorised for you so you know where we're at. This is the beard growth, the supplementation I've covered, the derm roller I've covered, I'm telling you about my, you know, my gym routine now, I'm trying to get back into it, you know, I got myself a new red strap from an Apple Watch, it's, I don't know if you've noticed it, I've got another little red dots on it and you can take this to the gym and fucking leave me for home. Oh, I'm gonna have to do now because the battery's flatlined from six attempts at getting this video because YouTube just seems to burn your battery out. So I'm kinda, yeah, shit, my battery gonna die before I get this sixth video done. So I'm gonna end it. I'm gonna say thank you very much for all you guys liking, so, you know, subscribing. Any comments, bang them in there, I'll reply. Okay, right, I'm gonna go. I'm off to the gym. I shall see you all later, guys. And again, thank you.